Hey guys, what's up? My name's Kane, and today I'm going to be showing you how to do super slow motion like Twixter in Final Cut Pro 10. So stay tuned. Hey guys, what's up? So today we're going to be showing you how to do Twixter like slow motion in Final Cut Pro 10. Now, before we get started, I'm just going to show you what this actually does. So as you can see, that slows it right down. You actually see it. Now you can actually make it slower than we're going to make it today, but we're just going to do it a little bit not... We're just actually going to do it so it's not 100% very, very slow and won't take forever to watch. So what you want to do first is select the clip and hold down Command R. Now retiming is going to come up. Now you want to select this. Normally this will be on normal 100%. Now what you want to do is you want to click that down arrow. You want to go slow and you want to go 25%. You can go 10% if you want slower, but I'm just going to go 25% for the purpose of this video. Now what what else you want to do is you want to you going to be able to watch that. And if it's a bit laggy, you're going to want to come up to modify, go to retiming, uh, video quality and then you want to click optic flow now what that's going to do is that's going to render it all over again it might take about five minutes to do so but it's going to get rid of all that lag that's in the video now i've already done that so what you're seeing now is with optic flow on and this was shot at 60 frames per second on a canon eos 60d now if you wanted to take that even slower we could also do that we could go slow 10% We'll just have a look at what that looks like. See, as you can see, it's turned a 30 second clip into a minute 30, so it definitely is a lot longer. But as you can see, it's 10% slower. Um, it does look a bit better. So if you wanted to try that out, uh, just put it down to 10, and away you go. So anyway guys, uh, yeah, if you wanted to make it even slower, you could check out Twixter. Um, it's a plugin for Final Cut Pro. I believe it runs about $600. So yeah, that's how to make super slow motion in Final Cut Pro 10. Anyway guys, I'll see you around in my next video. Bye.